Big shout out to the kid. Ooh, what? Uh, hey, what is good? Y'all, welcome to a brand new Pokemon fan game called um, Pokemon Blazing Hope. This was a fan game that I frequently found um, on, I believe it was in Poke Community. And this shit looked dope. They remind me of like one of those little score money games. Yeah, them black borders was bothering me, bro. I had to fix that up. But I seen this on Poke Community. It reminded me a little bit of them like score money channel games. And I thought it would be pretty dope to play on the channel because a lot of you seem to like um, the score money games. I don't know. But let me know your thoughts about this. I'm going to leave a link in the description below if y'all would like to play this for yourselves. It has a unique story, crazy good story, beautiful fan art, um, beautiful fake Emon on top of that too. We'll see what Electa Buzzard has in store for us. It's going to be fun. Wait, connecting. Oh, snap. We connected. Hey, what's good? Who this? Hey, shorty. Who is that? Oh, this is the newscaster? Hello there. My name is Julie. What's good, Julie? Uh, and I'm helping you with your new trainer registration today. Oh, snap. Damn. Julie, listen. Wait, do y'all got a speed up button? That's what I need to know real quick. Julie, uh, just the regular joints. All right. Cool, Julie. Thank you. Appreciate you. All right. That's what's up. No, no more info needed. Oh, Astro Rabbit. What? <laughs> is that a term? Wait, hold on. Is that like, oh, golly. Is that, is, is it something like that? Or is that, is Astro Rabbit like a nickname that you have for me a long time ago because you had like a crush on um are you excited for our new trainer here wait who astra rabbit is up oh it's a mon astra astra he <laughs> he so am i wait who's astra rabbit oh but you astra rabbit damn hold on okay astra rabbit i see you what's good from vast lands vast astral places from where astra astra rabbit that's what that bitch is called astra rat came from all right. Ooh, nice. Look at the sprites. I mean, I know I probably got the sprite in the banner right there, but hey, look, these sprites is dope, bro. The baby girl looks pretty cool. Dude right here looks, he looks pretty cool as well. I mean, he, the way he's holding the ball. No, pause. Uh, perfect. Now, how do we spell out your name? Damn, what should I name myself? Damn, look at the sprite animation on top of that too, boy. Hold up. They snapped with this. Hey, hey, bitch, I feel like a Kevin when I play this game. Hold on. I'll do Kevin. Yeah, I'm Kevin. Uh, all right, I've got you registered. Cool, cool, cool. Appreciate you, Julie. I almost forgot your name. Thank you for contacting Vagon's Department of Trainer Services. And best of luck to you and all of your Pokemon decided. I read that completely wrong, I think so. Oh, shit, we got a new DM from who? Taylor? Hey, what's good? It's, been, it's happening. It's like actually happening. Starting today, you and I, you know, the both of us, we're going to be legit Pokemon trainers. Hey, that's what's up, Taylor. Damn, I'm glad you DM'd me on Discord to tell me that. Because I ain't got no Taylor to do. Anyways, um, I know I've been going on and on about it, but Kevin, you have no idea how totally stoked I am for this. Hey, you telling me, hold on, because I'm about to be my own trainer. I'm about to be a champ. Wait, you talking about something about being a gym leader? No, no, no. I ain't gonna be no gym. Oh wait, our mom's a professor. Nice. But yeah, I'm not gonna be no gym leader, man. I'm gonna be a champion, bro. I'm gonna be Grandmaster Pokemon Flex, bro. I should have called myself Flex. Nah, nah, nah. But that's like exactly why I'm so psyched. Seems like with Pokemon by your side, the sky is the limit. Shit, the galaxy is the limit too. If you get a Deoxys, God, just tell your mom to hurry up. Wait, wait hold on. You better stop before I don't get no damn mind. Tell my mom to hurry up. Are you crazy? Or is she like trying to torture us with anticipation or something? Hey, that's a good rhetorical use, right? <laughs> She's always enjoyed playing with my emotions. Damn, mom's is like that. Just be patient, bro. Whatever. Just please get her to hurry up with whatever experiment she's up to. Your girl right here won't last much longer. Damn, she's really excited to get a Pokemon. Oh, who's this? Pops? Hey. Hey, Pops got that theme, boy. Hey. Hey, hey there, Kevin. What's good, Pops? Oh, he got the Animal Crossing theme. Oh, my Lord. I hope I don't get copyright strike. But now nah, we good. We good. We good. Hey there, Kevin. All done with registration? Yeah, for sure. Yep. Seems like it. Some was an eager be. I was going to say eager beagle. What is an eager beagle? What is an eager beagle, my nigga? Hold on. I can't. I, I can't. I can't believe I even wrapped that shit up. 
I'm sorry y'all had to hear the Coca-Cola in the background. One second. Someone's an eager bee barrel, dressed up, bag all packed up and all all that other fun stuff, nigga. It was good. Perfect timing too, because your mother called and she said that your starter Pokemon just got here in the ra uh, rab. Just arrived in the lab. <laughs> it's finally happening. You and me. Wait, what? Hold on. Trainers at last. Oh snap, wait. Shit. You a part of it too? Hold on. What's good? I've been waiting too long for today. I can finally make little Robert's dream come true. Who's little Robert? But enough of my daydreaming. Let's hustle to the lab, Kevin. Adventure awaits. Wait. Is my dad my rival? Hold on. Wait. This is the first time. This is the first time some shit like this happened to me. Hold on. Hey. You already know. You already know I gotta turn on that auto run. Damn, what's good with this? The University of Vagon hereby presents Emily Sequoia with this PhD in Pokemon psychology. Damn, so mom's really is a Pokemon psychologist. Robert Sequoia, recognition of research excellence, Devon Corporation of Vagon. Damn, and Pops. Hey, look at the way they did this shit. I like this. This is so. I feel like I'm a part of this shit, man. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. For Sino City. Hey, I appreciate you, pal. I don't know if that's what they call them, but two trainer dads. <laughs> trainer dads, fuck my life. Where did Pops run off to, bruh? That nigga's more excited than me to become a trainer. I, I mean, I don't blame him. He, saw, he was talking about something about young Kevin. Sounds like something that he wanted to do for a while now. This man said Route 49 gives me weird vibes, dog. I'm not gonna lie. Can't put my finger on it, but it's just some weird shit be happening over there. And I'm not just talking about the construction too. Wait, Route 49. Keep let's keep that number in mind, y'all. Cause I want to go investigate that real quick. Is this the lab? Where am I going? No, this is not the lab. Is it or is it not? Let's see. Oh no, that's the hotel, bro. My fault. My fault. Damn, this is a big ass Poke Center. Let me do my research real quick. A A A A A A A A A. What's good? What's good? What's good? Oh shit, my fault. <laughs> I ain't got no Pokemon. I'm over here popping up in the f force of habit, nurse. Damn, I was too busy jamming out to that good ass theme song, bro. Y'all heard that good ass Poke Center theme song, right? That shit was pumping. What's good, bro? Go on ahead to the lab, Kevin. Professor Sequoia, you should have just said my mom has something. Wait, what the hell? Um, Taylor, <laughs> how long have you been standing out here? Damn, Taylor, you are really too damn soaked. Too long, Mr. Sequoia. Too long. I like Taylor. Taylor's a good rival. <laughs> Tell me about it. Yo, old ass pops. Relax, bro. You gotta you gotta chill. Leave the leave the hype leave the hype to us, man. Wait, I'm not even gonna I'm not gonna kill Pops hype, bro. Been waiting for this since I was just a boy watching Tulio's battles live on TV, wanting to be just like him. Hey man, I'm glad we get to achieve that dream together. Yo, that's it's actually pretty heartbreaking, man. Like you and your dad, we, we you going on a um, poke adventure, well, separately, but you guys are rivals. This shit's actually beautiful. I like that. Hopefully, they were able to, like, iron out the administration issues they were having, apparently. What's that, Kevin? Our licenses came in the mail? Dun, 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 dun. Boom, boom. Ah, thanks, Kevin. No problems, Pops. No problems. Man, they delivered those so fast. Guess that's that new and improved DTS for you. True, true. There we go. What's good, moms? Hey. Sorry to keep you guys waiting. It's all good, all good. You know, I'm, I'm nice and patient. This bitch, Taylor, man. She ran inside that bitch. Yeah, she's dying, bro. Wait, Pops, you should have let me go. Hey, what's up, moms? How you doing? All right, guys. I know you're antsy and ready to go set fire to Vagon with your new Pokemon friends. But let me get some housekeeping done real quick. What? God, I'm telling you, your mom just left to toy around with me. As y'all probably already know, the main theme of my research is the psychology of Pokemon. It's my belief that understanding the minds of these creatures is the key to building a bright future together. Damn, Professor Oak would love to fucking work with you. It's already well documented that people in Pokemon can unlock incredible power when their hearts and minds are in sync. 
for example, Mega Evolutions and some Z moves. Hey, that's facts, that's facts. But I want to know what exactly happens in the minds of Pokemon when subjected to these phenomena. What exactly is the formula that causes these reactions, apart from just, you know, some special stones or crystals? This is what has been on my mind lately, and it's what I hope you three can help me accomplish or shed some light on. Of course, you three won't be able to use Mega Evolutions unless you can get your hands on a, you know, keystone somehow. Oh shit, what was that? Shake! Uh, honey, I think we're about to have a mess to clean up. <laughs> alright, alright. That's all I wanted to say. Just some food for thought as you begin your adventures. Go ahead and pick your starters. Finally! Damn, whoa. Oh, oh, damn. I was really hoping that you would just go first, bro. Why don't you go first? I have a dad. My dad is my, um, is my rival for first time ever. Why won't... Let you my rival, bro. Just go first. I, I won't pick anything that's against you. Oh, I'm talking about no biggie. She's slick. She she knows exactly what she's doing. She wants to get what's whatever's weaker. I mean, she wants to get whatever's stronger than my mom. Yo, dad, you want to go first? Oh, you goddamn adult. I see you, bro. Hey, oh, mom, it's my fault. I'm not trying to go nowhere. I'm just trying. To, oh, nice. Look, so we got the bear cub shrub cub. How y'all feel about this mod? Because, you know, I, I, I'll i choose anything that y'all are comfortable with. But, damn, I'm going to go for Sizzleback, bro. The Diamondback Sizzleback, that be look dope. And I know his evolution is going to look crazy. And then, ooh, we got Wari Puss, the Platypus, man. That boy look chill as shit. I don't know. I don't know. They All three of them look cool, bro. All three of them look real cool. But you already know I'm going to go for the coolest looking one. The Diamondback Sizzleback. Don't want to call that boy Cobra. Uh, let's, let's call him Cobra. There you go. Or we, we can call him Cobra too. Cobra is actually a good name. Almost reminds me of Kobe. Damn, this bitch went straight for the water type. All right, cool, 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 cool. We, we chilling, we chilling. Totally taking this one. Nice to meet you, Wari Puss. I hate your ass, Taylor. And she swears she's going to be the best trainer, too. Oh, we're cooked. Hey, hey. Shrub Cup. Dad, you're cooked, too. Hold on. I already decided I'm going to take... That's right, kiddo. I already decided that I'd take the Pokemon with a tight disadvantage to yours. What? Your old man loves the challenge? Ooh, okay, okay, okay. Dad, you're a good rival, man. Y'all y'all both are good rivals. You're smart. I like that. Kevin, Robert, I got both of you as a gift for the occasion. The latest edition, Rotom Phones. Oh, snap. Mom snapped. Oh, boy. Hold up. We that rich? Uh, 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 uh. Thank you, moms. Appreciate you. What? Uh, 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 uh. Hey. Oh, I thought I was going to hit it again for Taylor. Dun, 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 My bad. Uh, oh, you. <laughs> How'd you know I had my eye on this? What, you was going to buy it? How could I not? Rotom phones are an essential tool for any trainer in this day of age. No way I could see you two off unequipped with um for what's ahead. Sweet! Finally part of the Roto Club, Dan we was team Android this whole time. I've been telling you, man, these things are totally where it's at. Alright, face test. Relax. Oh shit, they come with a preloaded Pokedex app, a town map app, and like pretty much anything else you could ever want. They got the Rare Candy app, Debug app. They got um the Master Ball app, Super XP app. They ain't got those. I'm talking about I can have anything I want. Hold on, chill. Uh, da, 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 da. Hey. Anyways, we've got our Pokemon, so you know what that means. Wait, hold on. Give me a second. Let me at least introduce myself to my mom first. Hey, not in the lab. Oh, thank you, moms. Oh, you're old enough to know better. But mom. All right, whatever. Yo, you made her shut. But it does warm me up. Oh, I was gonna tell her to, to like, you know, hush up, not to kill her damn mood. Yeah, she's been seeming pretty bored and sad as of late. Do you blame her? I think this is I think this new beginning is just what she needs to get her mood back up. Well, what are you waiting for, Kevin? I mean, both of y'all like yapping in my ear. I, I can't move. Talking about what are you waiting for? Let me go. Just yap to yourselves. Alright, here we go. Wait. Taylor, one second. I forgot to go get my potion inside my very convenient potion inside my PC at home. Can I? Let's pause a little bit. Time for our debut in the world of Pokemon training. Daddy, you gonna watch this? Watch me win this. 
I'm gonna win both of these, Dad. Ladies and gentlemen, coming to you live from Fresino City, we've got an amazing and an exciting Pokemon battle that you've been waiting for. Kevin versus Taylor. Which one of these brand new rookie trainers will come out on top? Hope you're ready, Kevin. We're totally gonna knock you guys out. Ah, oh, shit. I was not ready for this. Hey, hey. Da -da 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 -da. Ooh, she got that type disadvantage on me. Here we go. Time to start our training. Listen, you may have a type disadvantage, but if I use Leer on you right here, right? Okay. Tail whip it up. Nice. You're not going to use... Please don't use Water Gun on me. Okay, so you, she doing the same shit I'm doing. But I got the crit. Oh, wait. I do got the crit. God damn. It's either I got the crit or it's it's that diamond that diamond um forehead that I got. That Koba got. Shoot, that didn't get so hot. You should have just used Water Gun on me, baby girl. I know you had that shit. Dang, I lost my debut battle. But I can't even be mad. For a beginner, you're like really good at this, Kevin. Listen, I try. I don't, I don't even know how I did that. Um, but you said better not get complacent, though. Because lots of trainers out there. And they're tough. Well done, Kevin. Seems you're getting the hang of this junk already. Now, let me tend to your Pokemon real quick. Thank you, moms. Thank you. What, me and dad is about to fight? Hey. Your Pokemon always gives their best for you. So you always got to make sure you heal them up, all right? You know I got this, moms. Damn, pushed out the way? Um, dad, you you a little anxious yourself. A little antsy yourself. Ooh, father, son, prophecy showdown. I like the sounds of this. But, dad, I'm not going to go easy on you. Just because you have, like, the type disadvantage on me. Your name is Robert, and I'm not letting you get away with a name like that. So, Dad, I'm going to hit you with this. Come on now, my pupil. Chill out, bro. First of all, you already know what I'm about to do. Amber to the face. What you thought you was about to do, bro? This nigga is Tom. He talking shit, and he going to use growl. Take your ass on, Pops. What's wrong with you? Are you crazy, bro? Move. I'm on level six. I'm surprised the other Dom didn't give me level six. That is game. That is definitely game. <laughs> what a thrill. That kid's already got the makings of one killer trainer. Let's not say that, Pops. Let's not say that. But I, I get what you mean. I'm proud of you, Kevin. Hey, thank you. Why? Being handpicked by Madame Stone for Devon's latest project makes me feel like the luckiest man alive. A new case study for my research and my husband gets to chase his childhood dream. Aw, I love that really is the best of both worlds, isn't it? Yeah, everybody's happy. Same thing for Taylor, too. Right on, Kevin. Those are some sweet battles. But you remember what's next now that we've got our Pokemon, right? Yeah, we got to become trainers. We going for that championship, girl. Let's go, me and you. Okay, so it's at Korobo City. All right, later, Taylor. Oh, and thanks so much for the Pokemon, Professor. Best of luck on your research. You're very welcome, Taylor. Good luck on your journey. Likewise. What's good, mom? Why you trying to huddle? Hey, um, take it from me. Having been having been a Pokemon professor for nearly 20 years, I truly mean it when I say that the world of Pokemon is vast, rich, and full of opportunities. So long as you always, so long as you always keep an open mind, I have faith that the two of you will find life with Pokemon by your sides to be more enriching than you ever could have had. Or imagine yourself. Just the same as me. I love you both. I love you both so very much. I wish you and your Pokemon all the best on your adventures. And while you and while I do want you to keep my questions in mind, what matters most to me is that you have fun and discover what Pokemon really mean to you. Mom's damn, thank you, bro. Shit. Oh my god, one last thing. You already said enough. I almost forgot to give you your Pokeballs. Oh, never mind. This is actually important. Thank you, moms. Appreciate you. See, everything is all about patience, y'all. Y'all always got to have patience, man. Patience, patience, patience will take y'all a long, patient way. My patience. Oh, shit. My potions. There we go. All right. Thank you, moms. For fuck's sake. God damn. She had a lot to say. All right, then. What's next for you, Kevin? Shit. What's next for me? 
what's next for me is that i'm gonna cut off this cut off this episode right over here psych no i'm not we about to go out our way to go to that damn poke center where nurse joy had tried my shit talking about i ain't got no pokemon very funny now nah, bitch who's the comedian hey hey even though my pokemon didn't need to be healed but thank you thank you thank you i appreciate you nurse what's good what's good remember move take your big ass up on somewhere damn whose kid is this ah take this break deck blitz Psh. oh damn he got my ass ma'am get your damn kid what's wrong with you oh z power that boy is using z powers illegally inside of a um poke mall center hey listen it's always not too bad to take more a little bit more pokeballs but we don't want to be too greedy now excuse me pardon me all right so where are we on to where are we headed to i guess we're headed here holy shit yo taylor what's good hey hey kevin is your pokemon feeling better uh wait yeah so we're ready raring to go let's go get registered racy to oh i thought she wanted to fight me again boy i was about to say i was not ready i, I, I just hit level six but i was not ready at all hey we're we made it to route 24 so let's go check and see what all other um fakey mon that they have here I, okay look peep this score bunny if you're watching this my brother in christ this is how you do it right here brother see how immersive like how immersive this shit hey, hold on hey 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 and sigor i mean in sigor i would keep you on, i would get you on the team but you sound like you are a fire type and we don't need no fire i already got koba on the team i don't need no other fire type let's see what else they got oh caterpillar okay now now we're talking so let's hit you with a tackle no 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 we're not doing that today i'm not gonna stay here for two for two years waiting for you i was about to say how you a level three and you giving me issues to catch your dumb ass bro to catch your bug ass boy hold up caterpillar the armor worm pokemon they hide themselves in the soil to avoid detection by the main predator Gallagrub. if it sees one of its own under attack it will risk its life to save it these niggas is dope yo welcome to the team you staying on the team man you a real nigga hold up and sigor that sounds like a freaking fire type you don't need another fire type <gasps> there you are you little shit i bet you you see my um rn nurse inside here huh tackle damn he hit my ass with a tackle too hold up you welcome to the team bro you are one feisty female bro Gallagrub, is that what they call you? Well, welcome to the team, Gallagrub. Good to have you here. Alright, easy. Gallagrub, let's see your stuff. Gallagrub, the quail Pokemon. Gallagrub uses its prized drill like appendage to dig its nest. Um, the more it digs, the stronger the muscles driving its drill becomes. Oh shit, what drill you got? drill drilling call you as drilling all right cool what's up are you naked my nigga hold on or is it just the striped sweater is just not um uh, uh, showing up over here we made we made eye contact time to fight hope your panties are ready rookie bitch who are you talking hold on hey hey oh he got the ala monk Man, this ugly ass munch Fuck out of here, bro. Growl, growl. Hey. What? Hey, hey. This feel like Persona, bitch. Hold on. I was not expecting that. Excuse me, pardon me. Mad orange berries. Pick these. Any day of the week. Uh, this bitch really gonna stop me. Ma'am, I'm just picking some orange berries, man. I hope you... How you gonna stop me from picking orange berries just to battle your ass? You gonna send out a Gallagrub? That's disrespectful, little miss. That's disrespectful. First of all, Amber. It's on what a bat it the day. I think that's what Amber says. Okay, I'm guessing it right now. Gallagrub is going to become a ground flying type, just like Watrell from the um this old old ass game that I played. 
you know i never noticed it but look at the lighting of this shit bro this shit actually looks pretty cool i like it i feel like i'm in i'm like literally in the city bro this shit actually looks beautiful as fuck with the music background music on top of that too that shit's just pretty nice what is she looking up here for is she looking up at that goddamn scary ass bug trainer over there i would be i would have been scared too if i was a bug trainer if I, I mean, if I was in the vicinity of a bug trainer, because bug trainers are weird and they say the weirdest things, bro. Trust me. Let me just grab this real quick. So I wonder, is there an EXP share all in this? <laughs> Damn, you are loud and proud, aren't you? That bitch got that hype ass bug catchers and all them goddamn theme. Hey, hey, hey. Switch you out. You got two mines, don't you? Hey, hey, hey. I don't know. What is this saying? Yay. He gonna fuck me up. Absorb? Really, nigga? Right. Oh, damn. Corabule City. What the fuck is going on? Yo, Taylor, you, Taylor May, you don't see this nigga up here? Hey, Kevin the Heel Dragger, over here. What's good? What does that mean? What are, you, what are you calling me? And why are both of these dickheads looking inside these buildings? The DTS is... Hey. Hey. Hey, oh, I'm going to get heavy copyright strike. And why am I going in front of her? Yes, ma'am. The real fun begins. And we are going to find out what that fun is. Maybe in the next episode. If you guys liked it enough, let me see. Let's see how many, how many likes we got on this... Um, on this video and i will make a second episode i do hope you guys enjoyed this showcase of pokemon blazing hope if you guys did i'll definitely leave a download link in the description below for y'all to be able to download it and enjoy the game for yourselves um hey hey i'm sorry let me know what y'all thought comment down below what y'all thought about the game if y'all liked it i'll make um i'll make a couple more episodes of it maybe might even make a series too if, if it gets like a lot of likes and shit like that but with that being said, I will catch y'all in the next video. Subscribe for some more Pokemon action. Like the video for that algorithm. See you later. Peace.